And here we go again. Let's pull it out and let's see what we got. The wind stream you're hearing is from this fan right here because it's hot in the room. It's like 82 degrees. This is not my regular filming time. Please don't be rude. Thank you very much. I appreciate you watching the video. But just don't be in rude and don't get in the comment box in rude. Thank you so very much. I believe this is that polar fan I've ordered. And let's see what we got. Yep, it is. It's a relatively small fan, so don't get too excited. But it's bigger than a four inch. It's actually a five and a half inch, 5.5. Yep, there it is. Let's see. Sure hope I got a good copy. Turn it around so y'all can see it right. There it is. Yeah, I know. What else is new, right, y'all? Yeah, well, nothing else is new. All right. Well, here it is. Let's see what the model number is. Model number F451 slash F454. Surprise, it has two type of model numbers. I believe the F5, I'm sorry, the F454 which is the second model number, is the black and the gray one, which the front guard is gray and the blade is translucent gray. And the model number F451 is this one right here, where it's black and the blade is white. So that's what it is, black. Okay, nothing else in there. Alrighty, let's see what we got here. I know this is not the most professional video, but again, don't be rude. I don't feel like breaking out my tripod. I just got off work. So I would ask that you bear with me. I'll do the best that I can. I'm kind of asking that you don't get rude. Here, let me do this off camera and I'll be right back. All right, let's see what we got. And here we go. I do apologize for all the noise, man. We're going to get this unboxed. So let's see what we're dealing with here. First of all, they give you a good manual here it's not too bad it's a little bent but it's not like a freak show type bent. it's just bent because the way they put it in here but here's your manual for the model numbers f451 which is the black one f454 which is the gray and black one so we'll see what model i got in a minute i believe i got the black one the f451 and here's that here is the fan itself out. Okay, put that down. Nothing else in there. Okay, here's your typical plug. Put this over here. And with one hand, let's try to pull this off. Okay, I'm not gonna waste no time doing that. I'll be right back. A lot of freak shows in this video that's what makes it a video all right let's see what we got here is the apollo uh, let's turn the light off so you can see the name if i can turn the light off if not oh well that's a lot better we'll keep it like this there's the name of polar so let's uh it's kind of lightweight let's hope this uh it's a bit of a freak show getting it turned on here we go let's see if i can get it turned on here
One, two, three. Well, it definitely has a start sound, a hum to it. Let me move it away from the camera for a little bit to see if I feel the air. Yep, it moves a lot of air. I hope this thing don't die on me, but you know what? I will tell y'all right now, I am not surprised at all if it does. A Polar is usually good about making good fans. So, we just have to see what happens. Give it about a week, and hopefully if they can pass the week, it's a good fan. If not, well, too bad. Don't, be on, don't get on here being rude. Don't do it, okay? Don't be rude. Thank you. It's a good fan. It's running. Not sure why it's modulating, speeding up and down. Maybe I need to, because I have it plugged into my computer. So maybe I need to plug it into the power over here. And we'll probably get better results. So one second, I'll be right back. I'm going to stop the video here and plug it into the power. Okay, we're back. I've now plugged it into the power. Seems to be doing a really good job. Hopefully y'all can hear the wind stream. This is a really cool looking fan. It's got vents on the sides, the back, and the front. Super easy to clean. You see that little notch right there? Hold on, let me put the light on. You see that little notch right there? That little tiny notch? Yeah, well, that's where you unlock the front guard to pull it off to clean the fan. It's dirty and believe me now it's USB and not battery operated it will get a lot of use and it will get dirty for the remainder of the summer then I have to clean it up all right let's see the spin down time all right there you go let's see if I can turn this around and get a startup sound I know a lot of people that like startup sounds this is a little bit of a weird fan so you got to Kind of bear with me as I try to get it to sit up straight if I can, given that it's a weird type of fan. <laughs> so, the way they made it, so let's see if we can get a start sound. And uh, here we go. What a freak show. Now it's not running at all, so I don't understand what I just did. One second, I'll be right back. Another freak show in the video. I found out that the plug right here wasn't plugged in. Let's try to start up sound again. Medium. Wouldn't necessarily call it a startup sound per se. More like a hum. And it only hums really good like that on high speeds. Let's try it again. I don't know if you heard it, but it has a cool start sound. Now medium power. Oh yeah, you hear that y'all? Start up sound. Oh yeah, I'm so glad it has a start sound. I was hoping it had one. Alright, let's turn this back around. Definitely not friendly, user friendly, as far as adjusting it's concerned. But one second, and there you go. I got it adjusted. So yeah, there you go. Here's my uh, what looks like a drum fan, if you will. It kind of does resemble a drum fan because the way it's made. It's a rather unique fan. I am glad that it has a start sound on. Um, continuous on. Um, and it moves a lot of air. It's pushing at about 4,500 RPMs. So that's a lot of airflow for a little fan. It is a 5.7 inch. They 
claim it's a 5.5, but yeah, to be accurate, I think it's a 5.7 inch, almost a 6 inch fan. But now we're talking about the fan blade, not the fan head. The fan head is probably about 6 inches. Alright, that's it. Let's power it down for y'all. I'm in this video. Spin down time is short. That's to be expected. Yes, it is a brushless. Those last longer. The month of fan in and out. I do hope you enjoyed this fan video. You're going to see a lot more of this fan in future videos. It's going to get a crap load of you starting now. The month of fan man and out.